green-eyed. Meghan hits the ceiling over jealousy of Harry's project with James Corden for TV show. Matt Thang. Meghan Lent Ran Vigenti Voidu and Kua Harry Voy James Corden Cho Chuong Trin Truyan Hay. When the Duke and Duchess of Sussex put down permanent roots in California last year, Meghan thought it was her time to shine. After all, she had left Los Angeles a struggling actress in 2011, packing up her life and moving to Toronto to film Suits, a TV series on a struggling cable network, knowing it was probably her last chance to make a big name for herself in the industry. Nine years later, she returned to Hollywood as a duchess married to an English prince, believing that thanks to her new royal status through her 2018 marriage, the showbiz industry would be her oyster. Insiders say the 40-year-old had convinced herself that she would have an Academy Award on her mantle within five years, but what she didn't bank on was her husband becoming an overnight success, overshadowing her within a year. The Me You Can't See documentary that Harry co-produced with Oprah Winfrey for Apple TV, along with a well-received stint on The Late Late Show with James Corden, has made waves among industry executives, according to our insider. Now. There are apparently offers flooding in for Harry at a rate of 10 to 1 compared with his wife. Prince Harry will allegedly replace James Corden as the host of The Late Late Show, but only for one night. In its January 17th issue, Star claimed that Prince Harry is the obvious choice to replace Corden temporarily because they are friends and both men are also from the United Kingdom. When you think about it, it does make perfect sense simply because they're good chums and of course, it would be a great way for Prince Harry to sell that book directly to the American public, a source said. However, Prince Harry's wife, Meghan Markle is allegedly torn when it comes to her husband hosting the Late Late Show. After all, the Duchess of Sussex is the one that wants to appear on television as frequently as possible. Meghan's been talking about going back into the entertainment industry. She could easily earn one million from making a five-minute guest appearance on a show, the source said. Prince Harry's possible gig is also allegedly causing problems in her marriage because Markle is proving to be a jealous person. Royal commentator Neil Sean has claimed Harry is considering taking over from host James Corden to sell his book. Of course, the Flame Hair Dad of Two is releasing a tell-all autobiography next year. And, Sean says he'll need to do something drastic to shift some copies. As a result, he told The Express, one of the ideas that they're floating around over at CBS is the fact that Prince Harry, for one night only. He also gave an insight into what the show could look like, with skits and jokes being filmed for the late night talk show. And, Sean added that while some may scoff at the idea and say it'll never happen, he thinks it just might. He added, let's not forget he does have to do something to sell the book. It can't be all serious, they need to be able to show a fun side. At this stage it's very early days but this has happened. In June, Corden also weighed in on the struggles that Prince Harry could be experiencing while residing in the United States. All his life, Prince Harry lived in the United Kingdom. But he was forced to change his path after marrying Markle. Corden told Howard Stern that he can't imagine that Prince Harry's new life is easy because he also had to make adjustments when he relocated to the United States with his family. But what made things harder for Prince Harry was the fact that he's a member of the royal family. And there are certain expectations and rules that he needs to live by. By the looks of it, Prince Harry has also adjusted to his new life as a non-royal. He and his wife are busy with their lucrative deals in the United States.